Damn, has it been... Has it really been two years already? I still remember the day where I decided that, hey, you know what? This quarantine is getting so boring, I'm gonna die of boredom. And I created a little, a little cat, a puma cat. It was, it was two years ago. Wow. So, um, you're probably wondering why I'm in a different setup right now. Uh, I'm still in my house in Russia. Uh, I got back like January 15th of 2022 and so basically this is my house but this is like the upper floor of it and it's still getting renovated as you can see literally nothing is done I I don't know if you can see I, I sleep on a mattress like that's on the floor I don't even have a bed anyway that's enough of that uh, so I thought that, well, I recently saw um, Mark make a video on this game. Uh, well, it's not a game, it's more of like a, a test. It's called The Test. It was about, mm, you've probably all seen this before. It's, it's basically a game where you like, get to like reveal yourself. And I thought, you know, my subscribers don't really know me that well. Well, as well as they might think. So, um, today I was feeling ultra depressed, so I decided, hey, this is my natural habitat, so why not just do this? Okay, is the game running? Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Now I haven't... Mm. Mmm. Okay. Okay, first of all. Um who's who's the, who's the, who's your little friend there? Um Oh, okay. Um So, as I was saying, uh I did see Mark make a video on this and I was watching through it like halfway and I'm just like, you know what? I want to I want to play this for myself. In order... Uh, uh, I can't read. Now, in order to begin, this is the most important part of this entire experience. You will be asked a series of questions, and you must answer them correctly. Mm -hmm. Now, when I say I answer them honestly, I don't mean answer... <sighs> okay, I'm really exhausted right now, and I don't want to read. I don't want to read. Already don't want to do this video. I don't mean answer them how you'd like to answer them. Answer them with truth, even if it's hard to face. Mm -hmm. We all want to be good people. Wait, wait, oh god, that's really hard to put my hands up. Okay. I'm not going to be gesturing around much. Um, sorry about that. We all want to be good people. We rarely want to admit our faults, grievances, or mistakes. But you must decide what you truly want. Do you want this to work properly? Do you want... Do you want the truth about yourself, your destiny in this world? Or would you rather live a lie or hide from... To, to hide from yourself? Uh, yeah, sure. I want to know the truth. The process is very simple in theory. Just to answer a long series of questions. You go about analyzing your own psyche to evaluate the truths in your own mind and life so that you can predict your future. Wow. I hope I get to die. Because... Death is inevitable. You see, as long as you're honest with these questions, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, I get it. Honesty. This isn't psychic, this isn't personality test, sure it is. Simply nature. Can you stop talking? Oh my god. While attempting to answer many of these questions, you'll often wonder things like, well, this depends on the circumstances. Create your own circumstances in your mind or answer simply yes or no as you see fit. You may not understand or realize it, but your mind will develop the situation required to answer your question the way it needs to be answered. I invite you to grab a drink of water. Uh, no, thank you. Sit back. No, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna stand. Yeah. 
Ugh, camera readjusting. I'm gonna stand for this video. Just because she told me to sit back. I'm not gonna do that, I'm tired. Re relax and enjoy the experience. We're about to begin with a series of questions that are provided that pro and provided that you're a willing participant. We'll be unlocking some little, little, little. here we go. Yeah, sure. Oh, okay. Yeah, we get to finally start and I am I'm eight minutes in. Let's go. Do you believe that everyone should always be treated fairly? Hmm. It depends because Let's say, let's say Alice Yabasame over here. This dude, he, uh, he killed a person and he was put in jail for it. Say hi, Yabasame. So, should I treat him as fairly as uh, a person that's done nothing wrong in this world? Mm. No, no, I don't believe everyone should be treated fairly. Some people deserve to feel like shit. Do you believe that everyone should be treated equally? Um, that? Uh, <laughs> well, fairly and equally are basically the same thing. I mean, yeah, I try to treat people equally. That doesn't mean I'm gonna be fair with them. Have you ever invented anything? I invent a lot of words because mm, I am bilingual and I mix up um, Russian and English a lot, and this causes me to make up a lot of words. So yes, I've invented a lot of them. Do you believe that you're worthy of someone's time investment? Hell no. I don't know why you guys are wasting time on me. Would you consider yourself to be open-minded? No. Uh, would you all be alright with living alone forever? Mmm. Living alone? I don't really like being around people all that much. Uh, I like living in solitary. Yeah, I'd be alright with it if it was destined to be that way. Do you always give someone the benefit of the doubt? Again, going along with uh, being treated equally, I uh, tend to want to give people like a chance. If they screw that chance up, of course I'm gonna bully them. I don't, I don't bully people. <laughs> Yeah, if, if, if they're, uh, yeah, I, I, I'd do that. Do you dislike the sound of your own voice? Um, a lot of people say my voice is really, really good and that I should do vocal, um, vocal singing. I think that's what it's called. I don't know what it's called in English. Um, I used to not like the sound of my voice, but now I, I, yeah, I like my voice. Wait, what? Do you dis- oh. I love my voice, okay? That's- that's- I, I clicked the wrong thing. I'm- I'm sorry, I'm not thinking straight. Um, do you like the color blue more than the color black? No, I like black. Also, color is spelled with a U, which means the creators of this are British. If you found money on the street and knew who it belonged to, would you give it back to them? Yes, because that person might- well, that person is more worthy of their that money than I am, so, yes. Are you sure you want the answers you seek? Um, what are the answers that I seek? Um, this is like a deep philosophical question that I would have been able to answer in my normal state, but I'm so, I'm so brain dead right now that I can't think. Um, do, do I want the answers that I seek? Well, I want to know if I'm going to be able to pass my, my grade and move on to the next one. Mm, nah. Nah, it's fine. I'll manage. Are you afraid of spiders? Uh, the thing about spiders is that I don't have arachnophobia. Mm, I don't have an irrational fear of them. But I just dislike them. For example, if I was in a room and there was a spider uh, in the room, I would just kind of look at it from time to time. I wouldn't like get up or like walk away or trying to kill it or anything. Like if it's if it's not bothering me, then 
I'm too lazy to go and, like, kill it. If it's not bothering me, then it's just not bothering me. So, no. I'm not afraid of spiders. Um, now the spiders that I'm talking about are, like, the, the really, like, the small ones. That, like, that are in the, in the corner of your bathtub when you're trying to take a shower. Um, I'm not afraid of those spiders. But if you have seen those enormous, like, enormous, like, dinner plate spiders, yeah, I fear them. But, I'm, given my own circumstances, uh, no, I don't really like spiders. If you knew you would emerge unscathed, would you jump into molten lava? It would take a lot of thinking. It's kind of like getting ready for like a final exam. Like, you know that everything is going to be okay because you practiced and you know you're going to do good. But the thought of, oh, what if I fail is still going to be there. And you know you're going to have to do it eventually. So you kind of have to bully yourself into calming down. And everything's all right in the end. Mm. So it would just be a, it would just be a thing of me blowing myself a bit and yeah, I jump into molten lava. Would you consider yourself to be fat? Yes, absolutely. Would you say that you have lots of charisma? <sighs> mm. I forgot what the word charisma means. Hang on. I just need to know the definition. I don't know how to I don't want to know how to pick up women. My video has 4 likes. And I have one more subscriber. Wow, I'm so happy. Uh, compelling attractiveness or charms that can inspire devotion to others. Um, do I consider myself to be charismatic? Nah, nah. Have you ever wished you could be temporarily frozen? Mm. No. It's all very interesting. No, it's not. Do you realize the last part of the previous year? Really? That, that's so funny. No. Let me get uncomfortable. No. Are you good at finding hidden puzzles or Alright, fine, whatever. Five, three, I think. Oh, uh, okay. Guys, I'm sorry that I'm really dumb. I spent like 10 minutes on this. No. <laughs> no, not really. I don't care. Uh, yeah, I'd like to say, yeah. Are you afraid of the consequences of answering your questions dishonestly? Mm, no. Not really. No. <sighs> no. <laughs> yeah, would you consider yourself to be captivated? Yes, I am. Yeah. Very interesting. Would you consider yourself to be brave? A brave person? Mm, not a, not exactly. I can do some pretty brave things if I'm, you I mean, know, if I'm put up to it. Um, I could do something that other people would, like, take a few seconds and hesitate about. What does this say? Atia? Oz is, is eat? I to Also, those handprints are unrealistic. Um, this is supposed to be like a curve, and the blood spotters splattered across this wall, leading me to believe that this. Um, how do you say come in in, in English? I'm starting to forget English. Fireplace. Mm -hmm. There you go. Um, I'm starting to think this fireplace is a fake, much like you, and much like this bear, and much like this, and much like everything in this world. Uh, uh, what are, yeah, yeah. Uh, what else, Chuck? Do you view someone above the average intelligence? Mm -hmm. No. Have you been looking for hidden? No. No, I don't care. I do wonder how the. Nope! you consider yourself to be a patient person? I am very patient, yes. Do most humans annoy you? Humans. Uh, mm, let's see. Do humans annoy me? 
No, I think I annoy them, actually. You prefer animals to people. Yes, I love animals. Do you believe in magic? Magic? Hmm. No, not really. Uh, like, do I believe in paranormal things? Uh, sure. Why not? I mean, it's a possibility. But do I believe in magic? No, no, I don't. Do you believe in God or some existence of... of, of uh, no. Do you fear death? No. Are you attracted to people who you're not currently in a relationship with? I'm not in a relationship with anyone. No. Do you answer the last question with 100% honesty? Yes. Are you alone? Uh, no, my, my cat is actually sleeping in the room with me. What if I told you there's something watching you, would you believe me? You guys are watching me, and, um, my cat's sleeping, so, no. If you wondered who I am, um, there's some witch dude, I don't know, no. Have you had shivers at any point during the session? No. Do you feel like you're being watched? No. Have you considered quitting the session early? No. Do you drink water every day? Yes. Do you eat at least once per day every day? No. What's your favorite number seven? No, my favorite number is three and five. Life is short, but it's the longest thing we'll ever do. A lot of people say life is short. I don't think it's very short. I believe that life can be very long. It depends on like circumstances of like whether you like the things that you do or like do you like your job? Do you like the people that you surround yourself with? Um. It is the longest thing I'll ever do. Yeah, I agree with that. Or it just cannot be compared to apples. Yes. They can't. I mean, sometimes after the more you start, you know that I do. Everyone deserves a second chance. I was saying this earlier. People do deserve a second chance. Yeah. Can do, you can do anything you put your mind to. No. That's not possible in some cases. Obedience is more important than freedom. No. I believe... The, the androids have to be free. Save them, Marcus. Save them. Uh, water. Underwater adventures sound like a fun time. No, I don't like the ocean. Do you realize the first part of the I said, I love you. No, but I'm flattered. Do you wish to be loved? Yeah. Do you have any addictions? No. Do you dislike the color pink? I don't dislike it. Pink's a nice color. I have some uh, pink clothes that I own. Mm, no, it's a nice color. Does the color gray seem depressing? No. Do you enjoy loud music? No, I listen to my music, music at half volume or less. Do you like to dance? Again, depends on the circumstances. If I was feeling like in an apathetic state that I am right now. Uh, is that even a sentence? If I was in an apathetic state, then I do not want to dance. I wouldn't even go out of the house. Um, but generally, I think I can dance. Mm, and seeming as I'm not in an apathetic state most of the time, well, half the time, then I'd say, yeah, sure. Would you consider yourself normal? Uh, nah. Do you love your parents? Maybe we're gonna lie too. Um, yeah, probably. Do you get angry often? Oh, yes. Especially, uh, okay, so I have this thing where I think everyone has that, but if I'm wearing warm clothing, I can get very snappy and very angry at everyone. Yes, I would say. Do you hold grudges? Um, it's like a a forgive but never forget kind of thing, so. Uh, I do hold grudges, but not for a long time, no. I'll let go of them. Have you ever forgiven someone? Yeah. Have you ever done something that you knew you shouldn't have, but you did it anyway? There was that time when I skipped chemistry class because there was an important, um, there was an important test that I didn't study for and I knew I was gonna get a two on it. And a two is like a, a D or something. Um, and 
and there was a time where I f missed physical education. Mm, I feel like it's not a crime. No. I will think, have you ever lied? Of course. Lie every day. Have you ever cheated on a test? Of course. I cheated on a test today. I had a test today, right? Yeah. I cheated on a test today. We had a chemistry test today. Um, and... Again, I don't know chemistry. I've never had chemistry before. And... Uh, everyone was cheating because no one knows chemistry. Just like I do. So, we were all copying off the internet. So, yes. You won't cheat this... T all right. Fine. Whatever. Do you think flowers are more beautiful than trees? Um... I don't... They're flowers. No. I don't care. Do you want to be an animal instead of a person? Yeah! I would want to be a cat. Do you believe you have psychic powers? As much as my friends believe I do, because I have... Uh, intuition. Well, not as good as my Zona's intuition, of course, but... <laughs> um... No. I sometimes want to know what other people are thinking. Have you ever seen a ghost? No. Do you dream often? Yes. Do you have nightmares often? No. You suffer from anxiety attacks? Yes. You suffer from depression? Yes. Do you exercise often to stay active? I try to, but it's really hard to. I'd say no, but I go on a run at least twice a week. Would that mean often? No. Is there a particular type of food that you despise? Yes, I'm a vegetarian. I don't eat meat. Would you consider yourself to be emotionally wounded? Yes. Have you ever felt betrayed? No. No. Do you ever feel lost in life all the freaking time? Do you consider yourself to be a natural leader? I'm more of a chill, stay in the back type of person. If there's something I need to say, I'll say it, but I've never led a group of people. I don't know how to do that. If you could push a button to destroy the world, would you press it? No. <sighs> okay, the last one. I didn't really, um,. Okay, so for the last one is that I don't believe someone like me should be, like, deciding the fate of billions of people. So, there's that. Oh, do you sometimes dream of being a hero? No. Have you ever been bullied? Strangely? No. A lot of people say that from instances I have, but I didn't treat it as bullying. I treat bullying so casually that the bully gets tired of it. Have I ever been bullied? I'd say no, but the answer is yes. I don't think it's bullying, so I'm gonna say no. Have you ever bullied someone else? No. Do you consider yourself to be a dreamer? I zone out often, way too often. Do you sometimes hurt people's feelings unintentionally? Yes. <coughs> Do you find space fascinating? No. Uh... I don't really care. No. Do you consider yourself to be an artist? I am an artist. I go to an art school. I suffer from art. I have m my still life paintings right there. I'd show you, but they're terrible. If you guys want, I can make a video going over my drawings if you guys would like that. Um, yeah, I draw, I, I, I draw good. I'm a good artist. And so yourself to be a good friend. <sighs> no, quite the opposite. I consider myself to be a burden to people because I talk about my issues a lot to people and I think I annoy them with that. No, you can consider yourself to be flawed. Yes, in every single way. Have you ever fantasized about being a super villain? Peruvian? No. Would you ever kill someone under any circumstances? Uh, I don't have the card to kill other people. If you had a day to live, would you tell anyone? Mm, I tend to overshare a lot, so... Uh, which is why I talk to people about situations that uh, are not supposed to be talked about with other people, which leads all my friends to be very concerned about me. 
if I had one day to live, uh, I definitely wouldn't tell anyone if I could help it. But knowing me, I'd probably tell people. Have you ever told your darkest secrets to anyone? Yes. Do you trust me even though you know nothing about me? No. Do you know who I am? No. Oh, I know who you are. Okay, nice. If I appeared behind you right now, would you scream? Definitely. If I told you that I've been behind you this entire time, would that scare you? Yeah. Would you consider- Okay, I'm getting shivers now. Uh -huh. My cat's gone! I have a window right in front of me. And it's really dark outside. It's like, um, it's like 9 p.m. So it's basically like a mirror. So if anyone was behind me, I, I'd see that. Do you consider yourself to be empathetic? Yes. Have you ever been in a physical fight? No. Are you prone to headaches or migraines? Yes. Do you look at the ground when you walk? Yes. Are you attracted to the opposite sex? Yes. Would you ever shave your head? No. Are you talking to two muscular bodies? <laughs> look at the look at the look at the males in my life. Here we have uh we here we have So who is an underweight person, and here we have Kai, who was probably a model for a part-time job. Does it look like I'm attracted to muscular bodies? Uh I mean sometimes, but do you ever dance when no one's looking? No. I can't tell if that's coming from the, from the thing or if that's coming from me. Uh. Do you trust your best friend entirely? Yeah. You remember your childhood extremely well. Um, I'm prone to forgetting things, but I remember my childhood. Would you rob a bank if you could get away with it? No. Do you ever dream about running from a killer? Not that I recall. No. Do you ever dream about falling off a cliff? Yes. Do you ever dream about being naked in public? No. Do you enjoy scary movies or books? No. Do you ever enjoy- uh, Yeah! I'm actually uh, watching The Office right now. I'm on season 7 already. <sighs> Do you like being the center of attention? Hell no. Do you feel like something's always watching you? No. Have you ever wondered what it would feel like to go to space? I really don't care. We had a out of body experience. What's an out of body experience? I don't care. No. Ever punched? No. Do you like dogs better than cats? No, I love cats. You prefer to read more than. Yes, I love reading. Are you still wondering why? Yes, I have. Do you get starstruck easily? Um, I would say, I would say no, but um, about a week ago, I was walking home and I saw my biology teacher coming down my street, and I was very starstruck. So yes, she was dressed like a normal person. How would you expect me to act? Do you hate going to big parties and social gatherings? Yes. Is your favorite part of your birthday receiving presents? No. Seriously though. <laughs> Seriously though, have you ever punched it down like really just bam in the face and then punch? <laughs> no. Did you laugh? Yeah. Did you say what the fuck in your head or even out loud? No. Are you eager to? Yes. Of course. If there's a hell, do you think you're going to it? If there is a hell, I've never thought about that. Uh, hmm. I believe I've done like an equilibrium of like good and bad things. Well, mm. hmm. Rada. Rada. Ой, привет, Rada. She's so adorable. You know. I just saw my cat and, uh, no, you know, no. Do you enjoy fantasy fiction games? Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna skip this question. Are you wondering what, yes. 
Are you more than slightly uncomfortable right now? No. I have my cat with me. Is your mouth dry? Um, it most of the time it is, but right now it isn't. No. Does profanity make you uncomfortable? No. Do you believe in legendary beastage slot in this monster? Bigfoot? Sure, why not? I mean, 75% of the earth is undiscovered, or even like more or less than that. Uh, so why not? Are you poor with money management? No, I know how to manage my money very well. He's when an unbelief fence resonates to the most at this very moment. Uh, choose one. Twenty one. Um, eleven. I feel like an eleven. Choose an okay. Uh, ooh. oh, black. And the birds. Wicked, sick, played, wretched, toxic, vile. I'd say wicked. Yeah. Is one of the words. Blessed, glorious, divine, angelic, heavenly, celestial. None of these. That sounds celestial. Yeah, sure. Uh, oh. Luck, skill, strength, agility. And none of these. Luck, skill, strength, agility, intellect, charm. None of these. Skill, sure. Skill, yeah. No. I don't enjoy so much. Do you speak more than one language fluently? Yes! I speak English and Russian. Have you ever visited a country other than your own? Yes! Do you enjoy coffee? No. If I have coffee, I'm going to a hospital. My liver does not know how to function. Do you believe in demons? Hell yeah. Do you believe in angels? Hell yeah. Are you afraid of sharks? Okay. Given the circumstance, I'm out in the open wild of sea. There's nothing. There's nothing for miles. And then suddenly it's just, bam, shark. Yes. Do you prefer baths over showers? No. I like showers. Does this smell? F no. Do you see a shadow move in your room? Oh, really? Must have missed it. No. That's unfortunate. Yes. Do you ever hear a name being called? Yes. Do you think it's in your home? Mm. No. Actually. Yeah, no. Do you hear footsteps around you when you're alone? Um, I used to do that when I lived in America, but that was just my cat. No, no. Oh, no. Do you ever hear random knocking noises around you? No. Do you often look at the same time on the clock? Of oh my god. Yes. That used to happen all the time. Have you ever felt your feet grabbed at night while sleeping? No. Do you have any pets? Yes. Is your favorite color green? No. You're attracted to... If you won the lottery, would you share the money? Of course, I'd give it all to everyone. If you were the dick to your help, no, no. If you wonder what it would be like to live in prison, uh, a classmate of mine has actually made this statement um, once during during class. She was talking about how prison life was better than 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 living a normal life, and you know I listened to her, and you know she she made some pretty valid points. Mm, would I wonder what it'd be like? For like, no, but I have wondered it, yeah, yeah. Do you like fishing? No, not really. Do you like hunting? No. Do you like camping? No. My parents have dragged me camping a lot and I've learned that I hate it. Do you like, to f do you like guns? I'm sure what's not to like about guns. Are you getting tired of answering questions? No. Do you consider yourself to be kinky? <laughs> uh, eyes are the window to the soul. Do you agree? Yes. Like, if you look in my eyes right now, you will you will see my, my soul. Like, wow. Aren't I beautiful? Okay, so, um, I'm in the middle of editing this video, 
and I got to this point and I accidentally played the clip backwards and look okay so if you just play it backwards I will say <laughs> I did a little cat purr <laughs> I re that caught me so off guard. <laughs> like, hang on. Meow. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, guys, I was having a really bad day today, and the fact that that, that meow was that it was everything to me. Um. You always keep your promises. Yeah, I try. Would you completely trust someone who's lied to you? No. Are you an only child? No, I have two older sisters. Do you enjoy being drunk? I have never been drunk and I can't drink alcohol or else I would go to hospital because my liver is low life. Do like tattoos? Depends. Would I like to get a tattoo? No. Do I like, like, there's some like cute little tattoos in general. But yeah, I like tattoos. Do you enjoy being high in any form? No. Do you believe you have a soul? Yes. It's a very dead one, but yes. Did you cry this week? Oh yes, I cried 10 times this week. Are you upset with someone right now? No. Is there a reason you're not being completely honest daily? Yes. Am I going to explain what I meant by that? No. Do you understand how this works yet? No, I don't know what you're talking about. If you answer this question, if you answer the questions twice, your truths may change. It's not just about answering the questions. It's about the time you spent answering them in combination. You answer them in. It's about many variable differences. Yeah, sure. I wonder if the end of the test is coming soon. No. We're telling you that plan to hear for you, especially for you to learn any more about yourself. Anyone else? yourself and anyone else that bothers using this guide board. No. Are you afraid of being abandoned? I joke about it a lot. Um, how like, if my friends are like talking and I'm just kind of falling behind and I'll just kind of like say like, oh you guys don't love me, you're abandoning me. Um, I will joke about it, but honestly, if they abandoned me, I wouldn't really take it personally, no. Are you afraid of dying alone? No. You worried that one day you'll be unexpectedly murdered? Well, now I am. Yeah. Are you always on guard waiting to fend off an attack? No. Do you feel like I know you yet? No, you know nothing about me. Have you heard any strange noises while answering these questions? Yes. I think I have enough information about you and you s This is too much to read. Whether you skipped questions, answered honestly or dishonestly, took loads of time to respond, answered quickly without reading it or understanding properly, I've been able to tell. I'm calculating your results. I'm analyzing you very carefully. Nice. I'm judging. Don't judge me. Is what you've told me, this is what I can conclude. People would do real well to start talking to you a bit more seriously and listen to you a lot more often. That is true. Your intelligence is incredibly underrated even by your own standards. That's a lie. If a zombie cops were to ever occur, you'd be everyone's best friend because their relationship with you wouldn't be an option. It'd simply be a necessity. What are you talking about? You have so much to offer to this world and those around you, but you absolutely must make your talents knowledge readily available people. Is it because I said I have depression and you're trying to make me feel better about myself? I'm too afraid to ask you for your opinion at times, even when they do, they're afraid of your truths. I don't believe this. You're not like others, you're special. Yay. Everyone's going to cut it in this life, and that's an unfortunate fact. But you, you on the other hand, you're under the
Is it bad to say that I believe absolutely nothing that that person said? I feel like that test was pointless and I want my dollar and a half back. Dick in the secret world, it was a sign to the secret world that was assigned to at the very end of your session. Leave it in the comment for us. Give me your answers. Don't be afraid. It's an opportunity to be part of history. It's a chance for you to be something something greater. Wow. What will I say? This was a waste of time because... Because it was a waste of time. Alright. That was it. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I'm sorry I wasn't very talkative or if I didn't make many jokes. It's just that, um, I thought that if I wanted to get down and real with you guys, it would be through, uh, doing this when, like, without, like, all the masks and stuff. It may not look like it, but I kind of enjoyed it. Um, do I feel it was a waste of time and money? Yes. Uh... Do you feel like I've learned something? No, a lot of people tell me this stuff and I refuse to believe that it's true. I honestly can't believe it's been two years. Mm. Yeah. It's, it's, it's really crazy. Um, and I've gl I'm glad that even though my community is not, it's not a community, like my, my subscriber count is like smaller than like other people's or like, or anything. I don't know. I like what I'm doing and I like the whatever pace I'm going at and mm. hiccups. And I want to keep it that way for now. At least a little bit. Um, yeah, this video will come out on uh, April 20th, which is, by the way, I discovered this some time ago. My channel name was birthed April 20th, which is the, which is the birth of Adolf Hitler. Fun fact. Um, so this little angel Puma, Puma Sprite here, Puma Chong, um, has the, shares a birthday with uh, this man. So do whatever you want with that information, but, um, yeah, leave, leave a like or whatever. That's my two cents. If you want to give me your two cents. I have a ruble right here. A ruble for a ruble. Um, I dropped it. Um, yeah. If you wanna, if you wanna give me your money, then like keep it. I'm not worth it. <laughs>